on YouTube? This is Jim G7. We're back for another video. So today I decided to try this one out. Uh, all of you guys know that when I work in my cars or anything, when I'm bringing anything out here, I always bring this out here with me. So this is my, I've been having this for three years. It's still going strong. Um, but this is a anchor and I bought this carrying case for the anchor alone. Now this anchor here, I've been using anchor products for a very, very long time. I trust them. And um, I figured that uh, it's time for an update on this. So the anchor, um, it's loud enough. Um, man, I, there are times I don't even charge for a couple of weeks and I'm out here working the car again. And then I'll bring it out and I'll use this and Bluetooth to my phone and play music off of this. Uh, but anyhow, this has been good speaker to me um it has two speakers here um <clears throat> you guys can see two speakers here um plus minus play button power on and off pushing down to hold it also your bluetooth uh, sync button so you push it and hold it you see a blue dot here and let you know that it starts syncing so i mean i've been using this um this anchor here for a very very long time so i decided to do an upgrade because i want my music to be louder while i'm working my car so today I got a package from Amazon <coughs> and we're going to do it an open box here too as well. So I ordered this and this, empty box, okay. So what did I buy? So I bought me a Charge 5 JBL uh, upgrade from the Anchor. Um, just came in, I'm missing one more thing but it's not here. It's a carrying case for this but it is what it is. This was a separate purchase off Amazon as well, this was like 19 bucks. It goes on the outside of the Charge 5 uh, JBL um, portable uh, mini uh, sound box. So I bought this, that way you can you know hang it on your shoulder or whatever the case may be. And um, it's, I bought gray. So they have blue, like dark blue, they have teal, they got black, they got red, and they got gray. And I think it's another color, I forgot what it was. This anchor here, this is the anchor here that I bought. I bought this one for like, I think 60 bucks, but this was a three years ago. It's still going strong, you know? This one here I bought, this was on Amazon for $179 for this alone. Double the price of the Anchor. So yeah, so this was double the price of the Anchor. So this was $179. So you look about $180 and some change. So over here has the presentation of this. Let me go ahead and dive down on close real quick. Okay, make it easier, open box and everything for you guys. And we're gonna do a sound compression test between this one and here and this one. You be a judge of it, which one's louder, and um, we'll talk more about it. Right? Catch you guys in a bit. All right, guys. This is the closest I can get since I'm doing this outside because Hannah's sleeping inside, so I can't do the in, uh, in the reviews the, the video inside. Okay. So first things first, we got the accessories for this. There's two, one more accessory, but it didn't show up. It's a carrying case to uh, to put it put it away safely. And it protects the the boombox, the Charge Five GBL. This one here was another safety here. This one here has your sling, and this goes around your Charge Five. So it's a silicone rubber. It, well, not really, kind of rubber, but it's like really kind of slicky little way. So it's more of a silicone. Okay, so they got something you can sit on. You got you can put your holes here, one two holes right here. So you can put your sling to it. So all of it look like this really simple nothing crazy okay like that okay <clears throat> now I'm down to the charge 5 so the charge 5 here the JBL charge 5 Bluetooth version 5.0 or 5.1 JBL Harman 20 hours of capacity of battery life okay <clears throat> this was a side looks like JBL party boost so let's say you buy two of these Charge 5. Two of these, you can do party, uh, JBL party booth, you stick them together and now your music will be even more louder. That's why I like the feature of this one here. Let's see, play and charge endlessly. Uh, we got 20 hours of play time, uh, IP67 waterproof and dust proof, uh, power bank, so you can use this as a power bank to charge your phone as well. JBL party boost option, okay? Uh, bottom here is just more little detail. So let's cut this open up. I'm using a 
cheap. So I can cut the sticker open. Okay, one. So this here folds down. Good presentation. Okay, so like this, fold it up, and there we go. So play and charge endlessly. Charge five. So over here, look like we got a pamphlet. Okay, it looks like your charging cable. This charge cable looks like a USB C, USB to USB C. Okay, put that back for now. I will take it out later. On the other side, what we got on the other side? Nothing. Oh, we got some instruction manuals here. There you go. So instruction manual, nothing crazy. Quick start book guide. Um, I don't know what this is. All oh, different languages. This is probably American probably. Okay, put those on the side for now. Okay, now to the main thing. We have the Charge 5. Good, nice, hard plastic case. And in the bottom, I kind of doubt it because it's sealed. Yeah, so then the other bottom. Okay, here we get the Charge 5 here. Nice wrap, protective. And here we have the Charge 5. So this is where it can sit on, silicone you can sit on, JBL. So I don't know what that button is. I think that's a party uh, party boost when you connect more than one um, JBL Charge 5. So let's say you bought three or four Charge 5 of the JBL. You stick them all together and then you got five, five of these playing at the same time. So I see a minus button, power button, Bluetooth button, plus button, and a play button. Just like the same thing as the anchor as well, okay? Um, over here, we got a little logo here. That's the woofer. Over here, got another woofer here from JBL. Okay, I haven't charged this yet, but we're gonna go ahead and sync it and play it. Um, I don't know what the world that is. That's probably the charging port, is it? Well, I guess it's two of the charging port and one USB, one USB C, I'm guessing. So it is sealed off, so that would be waterproof, as you guys can see. Okay, all right, first things first. <clears throat> I'm gonna turn this sucker on. Well, hold on a second. Let me get my phone and get ready to play the music for you guys. But let me get that uh, get that set up real quick. One, one second. All right, guys, we're back. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is turn this on. See the blue light blinking up? So now my phone should be already synced because I always play it all the time. <clears throat> I'm gonna double check. Go to general. Go to uh, Bluetooth. Oh, I guess I have it. Whoops. Forgot. I got a new phone. <laughs> Alright, hit the Bluetooth button. So now it's blinking faster. We got Anchor. Soundcore. Hit that. And now it's, now it's solid blue. Okay, so I'm going to play a couple of music. Just get the idea of how it sounds. <clears throat> Let's see. So I'm going to go to a YouTube music, go to this one. I spoke clay before I spoke words. Just out of raw clay, you can so that's make max, music. That's max volume right there. A little bit of clay can build That's max volume house. right there. So I want to forward it about the, the advertisement. For me, it was the beginning of my story to tell. Okay, so now you guys heard that. I'm gonna turn this off. Now I'm gonna put this on the side. Now I'm gonna sync this one here. I haven't charged it yet, so I don't know if it's battery in here or not. So I'm guessing this is the power button. Oh wait, here's the power button. Push and hold. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so I see an indicator here that's white. So we got JBL Charge 5 connected to Bluetooth. Now that's connected. Now I'm gonna put it back on here. <clears throat> now I'm gonna go back to the music and play it. Holy cow. You can, you can definitely notice a difference. I'm gonna crank it up. Dude, this thing here jams. This is loud. Way at least at least three times more louder than the anchor. Okay. Hands down. I'm gonna turn this off. So you hear a little um something that it throws off a, like a little kind it's kinda of like a chirp, but it's not like a like kind of like a little small guitar, like a did it, you know, letting you know that's off and on, off and on. That's pretty cool. That sounds good that sounds really good better than the anchor but don't remember you know i've been rocking this for three years you know so it's still going you know i'll still use it you know for something else you know like inside a house or something but yeah when i'm outside most definitely most definitely the jbl oh man that wow you're going about 50 60 dollar differences when i first got this Compared to a $179 and some change plus tax, you look about like $180 and something like that for a JBL. Man, pick this up. This is, man, that, that, that's something else. That is something else, guys. <clears throat> All right, guys. So that's just, uh, you know, a little, um, uh, kind of cut the shortness on the sprint review. So, man, that JBL is bad. That's, that's a bad, bad boy right there. For a little small compact like that, that small can produce that kind of sound and that, that loudness. Yeah. Cause I heard like, there was like, um, you know, rumors like, uh, yeah, that's better. It's good music and so compact and, but it's, it's expensive in a way. It costs more than the anchor, you know? So it's like, is it worthy? So when I brought my truck to get my truck fixed over there at um, Chrome World in Baytown, like one of the guys that I was working on a different, on a different uh, Bobtail truck, he had like three of these synced up. I was listening to it, I was like, man, that thing's loud and it's clear, you know? So I was like, I'm gonna check it out. So I decided to buy one and show you guys proof that, man, that is a bad, bad, compact little boom box right there. Can't beat it for, for JBL Charge 5. Very, very worth it. But for the money, 180 bucks, is it worthy? You beat us out of that. All right, guys, we're back. Okay, so you guys in the video already on this right here. So I'm gonna update you further. Now, carrying case on this JBL here. Okay. So I add the silicone to the JBL, hook up to this, and you can put this on your shoulder, carry it with you, whatever you want. Okay, and you guys know how this sounds. So I'm gonna play it this like this one more time. One more time. Okay. We're gonna put the same song again. Sickness. If I can find them. Let's go. Let's go. Here we go. I'm 
I'm gonna crank up the volume, right? All right, so here's the update, okay? So the update is that I had did an oil change on one of the cars. I had this on full blast, maximum volume. It lasted about a little over four hours, and I was kind of disappointed. I was like, what the hell? So I want to update this video here to you guys. This is about a week later, and I'll order another one of this. So my question is, if I want to add and buy one more and made it louder and use less volume to make my music louder to enjoy while working my cars out here, would it benefit to make the uh, the, the, the the Charge 5 JBL small boombox last longer? So this sounds very, very good. It's just the battery, if you maximize your volume on your JBL Charge 5, it won't last that long. It, probably, it won't even last five hours. Okay, and I like to play mine loud. So, bam, got another one. Okay, same color. I didn't get the different color or anything like that. Same color. Okay, and I got me another case. This is a different. Uh, I think it's a different case. Yeah, this is a different case. So it was, a, it was a, like a bundle deal, cheaper. So like, you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and get it. Get it. <clears throat> so we got this one here this different color here is called diva okay it has a handle on it compared to this one here it has a handle back here okay the, uh, the, the one you guys saw earlier last week so this one here you open it up this is more of a square shape compared to a traditional round so you see the difference okay open it up the holes in here is a little deeper it has a little pocket here for your cord, power cord to charge your charge five. The, the inside is kind of flown, but really soft. Compared to this one here, it's deeper on both sides. So it's like a sandwich, like a subway sandwich. Over here we got, it's a uh, softer material too, but this one here has like a whole bunch of squares in it. That way it protects your um, charge five when it's in storage. Right here, you know, you already put your cords, your power cords, whatever, whatnot, okay? <clears throat> so. Got another case, got a side, and we got another charge five. Okay, let's open this bad boy up. Yeah, nice. So what we're gonna do is, I haven't charged this yet. I just got it. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna party sync them together because you know the JBL has a nice feature of party sync when you have more than one, and they're gonna play the music louder. If you're gonna play your music louder, can you use lesser power that way it lasts longer? And I don't mind the extra, I don't mind the extra speaker at all. I really don't. So, let me open this bad boy up. I haven't charged it yet. We're gonna play it and see how it goes. What in the world? There we go. All right, cool. Now, same box, same thing, like just before. Nothing different. Now you get your stuff there. And we got another one. Okay. So now we got two. Two of these bad boys. Now the question is, I'm not gonna buy that thing. I only need one of these because I really carry these stuff around. So this one here, this is also a battery indicator. It tells you how much battery you have. So I'm gonna power it on. Well, this looks a little different. Hold on a second. Yeah, it is, it is a charge five. Charge five. Huh, interesting. It's different. Oh, wait, wait. I'm being stupid because I forgot the silicone here. See, the silicone it's on top. I was like, what in the hell were the buttons so different? Okay, so it's the same thing. So, this is also your battery indicator. It glows white. So, when you hit the power button on, See how it's white? So it has a fully charged battery here. 
okay i'm guessing because it's it's gonna go down a little bit you know because it, has, it hasn't been played so now i'm gonna stick these two bad boys together hopefully i can do it right this is my first time sinking party party sinking together Hold on, let me go to my settings real quick. If I'm doing this right. Bluetooth. Come on. Charge five. Okay, I got that one synced, I know that. Okay, so I'm guessing this one is sticking to this. So, this is the old, this is the, the new charge five. This one here is this one here. The one that's already connected is this one right here. So now they're connected, I'm, I'm guessing. Let's play the music and see how it is. Let's see if it works. Also, let's see how loud it is. So now, this was on max volume. This was whatever setting it was on. So let's find out how this goes. Where's that music at? Here we go. Wish I could rewind time and play it in my mind, play it in my mind. Oh Lord, you'll never know this love and how it feels. And never thought of at first I could feel so real. You brought emotions out of the feel. Okay, so in order to party sync it, I guess you gotta hit both of them at the same time, or maybe just one. Because when I did it, now I feel this one. Uh, coming out music. Okay, so now we got two, two of them together. Okay, so let's play the music. Let's see how loud it is. All right. It's definitely, definitely louder. So now I'm gonna turn this one off and just play this one and that way you guys get the idea of it. Turn this one off. Okay, that, that's off. So there's no indicator here. So now we're gonna play that one by itself. Now I'm gonna turn this one back on and let you hear the, the, the sound itself. Okay, at first I hit this button here and I hit this button here. It didn't do it. But I hit this one here one more time and then it sinks. So I'm guessing that once you turn this on, when this Bluetooth here stops blinking and you hit this power button, this party button here, then they'll, they'll sync automatically. So let's play it with both of them on again. Oh, you'll never know this love 
It's not showing the battery can indicate here. Oh, they're both not. Okay. I thought it was a battery indicator because when I turn them on, this thing goes, goes up. Uh, anyhow, um, yeah, when you play them both at the same time, definitely louder. I turn it off. This one here. Mason! I turn this off. Let you guys hear this for a little bit, for like 20 seconds, 15 seconds. Turn this back on. Party sync them both together. Play it, and you guys heard a difference. So yes, when you hook up two speakers on party sync together, it's definitely louder. Just an imagine if I add one more to this. Oh man, this is gonna be so, so loud. But hearing both of them, just hearing both of them alone, it's loud. It, yeah, most definitely loud, okay? Uh. But yeah, I just want to give you guys an update on that because I play it, like I said, I use it for uh, that one weekend, did all the change, had a max volume. It lasts about four and a half to almost five hours, just a little over four hours. And they start dying on me. It's like, why the, the speaker cut off? And I want to go check this thing was blinking. Hey, this thing here was blinking and it wouldn't play anymore. So it was out of battery. It's like, what? So I was like, why don't I just go ahead and buy another one? May make it louder, but use less power a little bit and that way it lasts more longer. I, I want to at least last about six hours because I, I like being out here working on cars. I like to take my time and join my music as well when, when I'm out here, you know what I mean? So, give and take, guys, it's a big thumbs up when you sync them both together. It is. It is a lot louder. <clears throat> but the price to pay for both of them, 179 for this. That's not including the carrying case. This deal here, when I bought the second one here, it came with the case as a bundle deal for 179 together. So you can buy this, uh, this, and it comes with the carrying case. So that's a thumbs up, but it won't not come with the silicone case. Okay. So again, I'll add the, uh, I'll add the, uh, the, just use the links and do a little research on Amazon. You will find them. Okay. So the link is already there. Just go ahead the very bottom of the link. If you decide to get one, get one for yourself. If you have more than one party sitting together, if you have five of them, you're probably sitting together and all five speakers will play, okay? Guys, give me a thumbs like, hit the subscribe button down below, hit the notification bell down below. Every Friday is always a new video. Um, at 15, I wanna throw a reminder, at 15 subscribers, no giveaway. At 2,000 subscribers, I'm gonna do a give, another giveaway. But guys, be patient. Every Friday is always a new video. Without you guys, I will not continue making this kind of type of videos and give you um, uh, wisdom, knowledge, and entertaining and enjoyable videos for you guys to watch. And yeah, so JBL, as off the chart, one one of the best compact sub you can have. But adding a feature of party sync, if it, if this option did not have party sync, I wouldn't just buy another one. I would just use that one. But since it have party sync, party sync together on music, hell yeah, this thing is a lot louder. I mean, you guys notice it. I'll play this by itself at the very beginning of the video. You see how loud it was. Good sound. Uh, good uh, good enough bass. Open the box. Sync this one to this one here, and this is not even charged yet. I sync this one with that one. I didn't have to Bluetooth that to my phone. I just sync this one to this one here, and it played. 
when I had both speakers on and I showed you both were popping on the, on the bass on the side of the sub, they were both playing at the same time. And it is way louder now. Now just imagine if I add one more or two, two more and have them all five in sync and do a whole bunch of surround sound here, <laughs> it's gonna be loud, okay? So yeah, I highly recommend it. If you guys are able to get one of these uh, sub uh, JBL Charge 5 um, uh, subcompact uh, uh, woofer box, boom box, for your enjoyment while you're working your car or outside or even um, you know with traveling or you're camping, get one, you know, it's really good. Compared to my old anchor ad that I had, yeah, it's thumbs up. So I can have one facing this way and I can have it facing this way here when I'm working on my car and then I can enjoy my music when I'm out here working. Guys, you know, usually when I'm out here working, it'll be more than two hours. So you do an oil change or whatever, whatnot. Okay, guys. All right, guys, that's all I have right now. Thank you for watching. Peace, I'm out. I just wanna throw an update here um, of me getting the second one and that way you guys can see for yourself and hear for yourself on party sticking the JBLs together. All right, guys, peace, next time. Oh, 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 oh,